so this patient uh, has an acute anterior wall MI. Uh, he's a drug defaulter and has left uh, his medications since the past uh, four to six months. Uh, as you can see, that uh, the previous stent was placed here. Um, it was a primary PCI for stenting to LED uh, done in the rainy months. And uh, there's a new lesion that has developed here, and there's a huge thrombus burden. of the pain. So as you can see that uh, we've taken an aloe caudal view and we're trying to wire this. This is a Visper uh, ES wire and successfully wired. Uh, we've gone distally and yes after some daughtering uh, we've inflated and pre-dilated with a 2 by 10 mm balloon. Some pre-dilatation again some pre some more predilatation and after the predilatation we can see that there's a huge thrombus uh, burden right here and everywhere it's an organized thrombus off and uh, this is from the cranial view you can see that the proximal portion of the stent the previous stent has been uh, burdened with a large thrombus even the proximal portion is a little easy that gives clue that there's a huge thrombus. Anyways, we're replacing the stent here, and uh, this is the distal stent placement. Uh, we're using a 3.5 mm stent. After some uh, initial checks, uh, we're inflating the stent side. Yes. So the previous stent was about 3.0 by 33 mm, and this is a 3.5 by 32 mm stent. And uh, we have uh, pushed the stent balloon distally, and uh, you know just to give a good stent uh, overlap of the overlap segment to the post dilated here. And after the post dilatation, then we can see that uh, good has been achieved uh, so we are trying to pull dilate it with a 3.5 mm balloon NC balloon 3.5 mm NC balloon has been used and uh, again we have done some pull dilatation aggressive pull dilatation is the key because to achieve good stent apposition so never be too hasty not do post dilatation and uh, obviously it is very needed. I'm doing some post dilatation and yes, I think we've achieved our really good results and yes, very good. So, as you can see, we remove the wire, the distal portion is looks good. Uh, the stent has opened really well and you can see that good results have been obtained. Let me just go back to the initial shot where you can see a hundred percent thrombosis here and the final shots. Wonderful uh, opening of the artery. Good flow, T3 flow has been achieved. Good stent apposition. Patient immediately uh, became alright, pain got relieved and